Hi everyone, thanks for joining me in another video with me, Binny Blocks. In this video, we're going to look at Collect All Pets game. There's a bit of following on this and uh, around 4,000 active right now. Let's dive in and have a look. So in this game, we have pets. We have to collect all the pets, uh, as the name suggests. So let's hatch our first egg. It's a common one. Let's see what we get. Common ball. Over here, uh, we've got the number of pets that we've collected so far. So let's have a look around the first area. Here we have leaderboards. Over here we have a portal of some sort, so we have to collect 240 pets to be able to enter it, I think. This, these are event notifications, so there's a double gold weekend that starts this Friday. And here we've got a uncommon egg prize that you can claim each hour when you reach a total of 15 pets collection. Speaking of the collection, if you tap or click on uh, this number 1 over 24, it tells you how many of those each rarity that you've collected so far. That's actually quite good because in other games, in other sort of simulators with pets and minions, for example, they've uh, got a separate index machine. But here it actually tells you on, on the menu screen, which is quite handy. Um, I can see an egg up here in the tree. Let's try and get that egg and see if we can get a different pet. There we go. So as soon as you touch the egg, it hatches. And we got a chick. Now we have two. Oh, 42. So now I'm going to try to figure out where to get the other eggs now. There's, there's a couple up here, I can see. Can't really jump high. There aren't double jumps in this game either, so this is going to be a bit tricky. Maybe I can parkour up here. Sorry. Sorry for jumping on you there. There we go. That's how you get to that one. And we have a tiger. And then you can equip your new pets from here. Or you can click equip best. And there's also a fuse menu. So you can fuse five pets of the same rarity. Fuse into an uncommon pet, so the next level up. And I suppose that will help you get your pet index completion. You can't actually click on the gems in this game. You just have to run around and collect all the coins that come off them. Super simple gameplay. It looks really nice though. Let me know in the comments what you think of this game so far. So right now I'm trying to figure out how to collect more gold faster. Um, at the top here we've got quest completion, which gives you an egg as a prize so we just hatched a red squirrel and then the next objective is to collect 10 drops there's 10 so we get another egg a pink ram got five pets so far already brilliant let's see how many we can equip there do seem to be more slots available so we're going to try and figure out how to equip more pets soon as well we've got an auto hatch option as well so if i take that oh we got some sort of horse <laughs> It flashed up and disappeared, so we've got a brown horse. I think you can camp here with auto hatch on and it will just keep hatching eggs as soon as you've got enough coins to do so. Let's get the next achievement and that gave us a meerkat. Now I'm going to fuse some of these pets so they don't have to be the same pet. You can put in any five pets of the same rarity, so all commons and then hit fuse. Aquatic hatchling, wow that looks pretty cool. I have to say the build quality in this game is really good. The pets look really good, they're really original and they actually look like the same shape of real life pets <laughs> that they're meant to be like. Uh, this area is blocked at the moment so to get to the next area you need to discover 15 pets. So we can either hatch 15 different pets or hatch and then fuse into 15 different pets that way. So each pet you hatch or fuse has a 1 in 1000 chance to become shiny. You will receive plus 1 shiny skin for that pet type. If you lose the pet from fusing or rebirthing, you will keep the shiny skin, which will be automatically applied to the next pet you get of that type. Shiny pets deal 80% more damage. So it sounds like we do want shiny pets where possible. They will help progress in the game a lot quicker. You can't actually trade in this game, which makes it a little bit more uh, challenging, I suppose. But I suppose you have to do the hard work yourself. But that's alright, that's what we're here to do. If you're enjoying this video, remember to like, comment and subscribe. Hit the bell for more great videos. Over here we've got a, a damage increase upgrade for a thousand coins. I haven't bought any damage upgrades yet. It instantly applies your damage upgrade. So I think I will max this out. I've got enough pets to fuse another one again see what we get. A snowy owl. Very nice. And now look at the little meerkat. <laughs> I'd imagine that's how he'd actually do it in real life. 
I think I've got enough to get two more eggs. So I'm going to auto hatch them. Hopefully, get two different ones. Yes, got two different ones, and they are monkey and otter. So now I have enough to fuse again. So let's do it. White alpaca. This new area is called the forest. Uh, use this button to make your pet stay in the current area if you leave. So if I click that, the pets will stay and grind in this area. And then up here on this tree, we got a couple of eggs. Let's collect them. Free eggs are always good. Bushy squirrel. And there's a couple more eggs to collect. A pink ram. And here we've got a upgrade to buy plus one pet equip. Oh, that's cool. So you can just buy it with in-game currency. Let me know in the comments what your favourite pet is in this game. Look at this one. It's so cute. Little seal or narwhal, I think. <laughs> There we go, unlocked. So easy. And now we can equip five altogether. I've just noticed as well that inside this little cabin there's a free egg there to hatch. Angry Dino, <laughs> nice. We've got 21 altogether now. And I think I might have, have enough to fuse again and have enough equipped as well. Wow, sour turniper. That's different. To get to the next area, we need to discover 40 pets, so it's getting a little bit more difficult now. It seems like the best way to improve in this game quickly is to just keep getting these achievements. And if you click on the trophy icon, it tells you where you are in the overall sort of achievements list. I'm going to fuse these because I need more pets. A Ram Mumu. What's a Ram Mumu? Whatever it is, it looks cute. Hopefully get something new different. A chili iguana. Look at his face. Oh. <laughs> what is that? A moustache shroom. A mushroom with a moustache. That's awesome. And because I've only got five equip, I'm going to just keep fusing these. Oh, nice. We've got a springy unicorn. That looks kind of nice. Here it is. 40, Mountain Goat, got it. Thank you, Mountain Goat. You helped us get to the next area. One thing I do like about this game is that I don't feel too precious about these pets because you actually have to fuse them to play the game. Um, it's part of the game, and um, since you can't trade the pets, the only thing you can really do with them is fuse them. And the next area is the desert. Oh, just noticed one on top of the cabin there. How can we get up there? This is cactus here. There we go. And we got a story dino. Oh, that looks really nice. I'm going to grind away and farm loads of coins to get to the next area. We need 75 pets discovered to get there. If you've enjoyed this video, let me know in the comments. Drop a like and uh, subscribe for more great videos. Hit the bell for notifications when they come out. And if you've played this game, let me know how far you've got, what your favourite pets are. And also let me know if you want to see more videos on this game as well, to see the progress through this. I personally would love to play this game again and uh, record more videos for you guys. So let me know if that's something you want to see. But uh, yeah, thanks for joining me. Thanks for watching. See you in the next video. Take care. Stay safe. Beanie Blocks out.